Roof blown off of Pat's Fisherman's Wharf restaurant. Debris has fallen on cars in the parking lot. Al Bear has been in Henderson all morning. He's been inside. Let's find out where he is now because uh, he's doing a great job of assessing the damage. Al? Hey, guys. You know what? We were here. This is our first hit this morning. Well, our second hit this morning. Uh, but with the sun up, you can see it much better. You can see that this, which I think was a rafter of some sort. I've built rafters before. This thing came through here, went to the through the window of this SUV. Uh, and look at that. I tell you what, to me, this has got to be some real velocity to take this and just like shoot it to stab it through the window of this. Uh, Gonna get under here. We're gonna we're gonna take a look around at some more stuff. I got to tell you, this we're behind Pats of Henderson, uh, seventy-five year old family restaurant. Uh, many of us have been here many many times. Uh, sadly, there was a death near Cecilia, uh, but so far we haven't heard of any injuries or or deaths here in Henderson. But come on over here. This is kind of an, again. Look at this. I mean, straight throughout the passenger's door, you can see just what a mess. And back here. I was trying to figure out what this was a little bit earlier, but this, this is the cooler. And take a look at this thing. Now these things are usually structurally pretty sound because they have to be insulated. You have a lot of heavy equipment here. Uh, you have giant uh, uh, refrigeration devices. And that wind came through here and just tore this thing apart. And you can see on the ground is all the insulation from the cooler. And back there, you can see the the four fans that just keep the cool air blowing in here. This this is a mess. And of course, another car here, Mr. Huval, Mr. Ju Mr. Jude Huval, who we talked to a little bit earlier, was telling us these vehicles belong to his employees and how lucky they weren't getting in or out of them at the time. But take a look at this. Tyler, be careful. Look at the hole in the hood of this car. I mean, something just came through here boom and stabbed a hole into this uh, that's pretty amazing and again ag again you have what appears to be maybe a rafter through this I mean of course I think the rafters come from the roof over there uh, part of the roof for the restaurant the roof is com completely gone from the little motel out here but this this will give you an idea of how strong this wind was and you know Adam Olivier says all the time stay indoors this is why you stay indoors, because these things are like projectiles. And you know, if they can penetrate a hood or a windshield, it's, it's pretty bad. So what we're going to do, we're going to go back to you guys in the studio. We're at Pats of Henderson. And you know, Al was telling us when he was inside and did such a great job, Turlings was going to have a graduation party there right after. Imagine it could have been so much worse uh, just in terms of timing. Could have been uh, yeah. it's so much worse, yes. But Al, yeah. thank you so much for, for really taking us inside and, and giving us the insight yeah. that we all thank need. Thank you. Can't wait to start those cleanup efforts and figure out how we can help. Yeah.